yeah, I thought it was a very good game. Um, you know, first of all, I'd like to say, appreciate everything that Stanway Rovers have allowed us to come over. Um, and obviously, you know, they've, they've done amazingly well. We're getting a, a decent pitch over here. So without that tonight, we don't get the game goes ahead. So uh, I want to say thanks to them and uh, hopefully we can build a relationship with this club. Uh, it was a good game, competitive. I um, thought we were a very good first half. Uh, they looked very strong second half. And uh, But listen, we were tuning up. Disappointed with the goal. Thought we gave the goal away a bit sloppy. Um, should have done better with that, uh, in my opinion. But I think it just come from Chrissy Gregan should have overloaded the ball and he tried to play it into, I think, Loza and he got nicked and uh, we didn't defend it well from then on. But uh, overall, I thought we could have had some more goals at the end. I thought the chances we created were very good. Um, obviously, we you know we put a lot of sort of young trialists on at the end as well. So um, you know we want to try and give everybody a little bit of game time if we can. But you know, like, as I said in the last previous interviews, you know pre-season's pre-season. But I think what we're starting to see is that we look like we've got a decent foundation of players. Um, it's nice to keep a winning streak in, in, in your games as well. But just pleased that we've managed to um, you know come off of it. Hopefully, touch with injury free. Um, still scored some couple of good goals tonight. Obviously, a little bit of a mistake there by the young goalkeeper on their behalf. But you know we had to put the ball in the back of the net. And um, but no, overall, I thought it was a good exercise. I'm sure um, Peter will go away from there and, and Terry and sort of look at that and think, well, that was a good test. Yeah, that's all you can really ask for in pre-season friendlies is to, you know, it's no point just when you're beating teams four nil, five nil. You want games like that, you know, competitive. Obviously, our boys know we've got to up the standard a little bit there full-time. They're a league above. Um, but overall, I thought the boys was excellent and um, really pleased. It, me and Nick, we were aware they were doing 2.45s and we knew that they would be, uh, you know, they would be uh, tough both, both halves. But the second half, I think you could see they were a lot stronger, uh, a lot more physical, um, good players, you know. And I think they just signed a boy quickly who, to be fair, took his goal well, but I felt we could have done better. Um, in, in stopping and get, you know, getting a free shot off really like he did. But uh, they were strong. And, um, you know, when you've got players like Kenny Clarks and that sort of thing, I know they never had a recognised goalkeeper tonight, um, which obviously did them too many favours. But they give a young lad a chance to go in there and, you know, enjoy yourself in a pre-season game against what I'd like to think respectfully, you know, a good side of Chelmsford. So, you know, overall, I think everybody's done what we've had to do. Uh, the exercise is suited. I think it's only their second game. That's now our fourth game. So, you know, to be honest, I think it's uh, I think it's been a good exercise for them and it was a good exercise for us. And, um, you know, hopefully, uh, I don't think we're going to play possibly now on Tuesday because I think that friend has gone down. Uh, so we have to wait to the All Church game. But, listen, maybe a little break in the week might do us a bit of good just to get back to do some more training. But, um I thought the boys looked fairly fit, you know, we've asked them to work their socks off and drop into shape and things like that. And that's what you have to do pre-season, you know, you have to run around and get your minutes in and, and, and try and get your groundwork done. So that's what we've done tonight, so uh, we move on to the next game against Hornchurch.